Well, Singapore's semiconductor industry is getting a boost with a new silicon wafer manufacturer facility. Opened by German company Siltronic, the factory will double its manufacturing footprint and create 600 new jobs in areas like engineering, research and development. The new facility will make disks like these that serve as the base material for semiconductor chips. They'll go on to make some of the most advanced wafers specially tailored to support the high processing speeds needed to power laptops, smartphones and even AI servers. Speaking at the launch event, Deputy Prime Minister Hing Sui Kiet says this will drive breakthroughs in other areas like the green transition and better healthcare solutions. And that's why Singapore is investing to grow the semiconductor ecosystem for existing industry partners while supporting innovative ventures. With dynamic local suppliers and global firms from different parts of the world, focusing on different parts of the value chain. This rich ecosystem enhances the overall competitiveness of the industry in Singapore. We are confident that the industry in Singapore will continue to innovate and make wafers and chips that are more productive, powerful and sustainable. Siltronic has invested some 3 billion Singapore dollars into building this facility and it's not ruling out pumping more to ramp up wafer production in the next few years. That will mean hiring more skilled workers in areas like engineering, IT and chemical supplies, along with those who can help it achieve its sustainability goals. A key uh, feature would be to decarbonize our, our overall uh, operations. Yeah, sustainability is a big keyword for the next couple of years. So we will uh, look how to further get green energy supply into our FAB and, and with that overall help our group targets in terms of uh, climate. 